Good morning, people of YouTube. Happy Saturday. TJ here with Daily Grind Fantasy Sports. And in this video, I'm going to be comparing major sports books lines to prize picks lines. And we are going to build a five or six man flex for prize picks. To do this and create a plus EV slip on prize picks, we will be going to dgfantasy.com to the all sports tab and clicking off our prize picks optimizer tool. If you guys have not heard of DGF, first and foremost, and you are stumbling upon this YouTube channel for the first time, you can go ahead and hit that subscribe button below. Go ahead and give this video a like if you could, and also turn on the notification bell whenever we do post videos, you will be made aware. But guys, dgfantasy.com, if you're looking to give us a shot, maybe you've been on the fence about getting a potential membership, guess what? Go to membership options at dgfantasy.com. Right down here below, you will see a three-day free trial, all-access membership. Click sign up right there, and then boom, guess what? You get three free days, and then your month kicks in. Now, what this means is you're going to have to put in your information, but if you are unhappy with the product prior to your three-day free trial being up, simply cancel, and you will not be charged. If you're happy, obviously, after your three days, that $55 charge will kick in. So again, if you want to try dgfantasy.com right now for three free days, go to dgfantasy.com, click on the membership options top right, scroll down, hit sign up, and then boom, you get three free days prior to being charged. But enough of that hoopla, guys. Let's go ahead and jump into, again, this five or six man flex, depending on what we have on the board. I've yet to look, so this is gonna be exciting for me as well. All right, guys, I've pulled up the All Sports Prize Picks Optimizer, and here we have it. We have a bunch of viable plays for not only a five man, but a six man flex. For any of our DGF members that are out there that are confused on how to articulate which play is okay for what slip, we've made that very easy for you. You see right here the plus EV recommended plays. All you have to do is click this drop down, and what that will do is filter what plays are okay to play in a specific slip. All right, guys, let's get back to the slip. We're going to start here at the top. We have a really good play kicking it off. Tyson Walker. Now, first and foremost, if I'm, I'm going to build out a six, man, seeing as there's a ton of value. With that being said, if you can't play college basketball, this one college basketball prop will be incorporated into the six-man flex. So if you can't play college basketball, simply revert down to a five-man. All of the other plays are viable for a five-man slip on prize picks. But let's start with Tyson Walker, over 13 and a half points. FanDuel currently has this at minus 184 to hit the over. Now, Normally, I like to see a little more book support, but with these heavy odds on the over, it would be very dumb for us not to play. Currently a 61.1% fair odds percentage to hit just based off this FanDuel number. Again, a minus 184 line. After that, we have Matt Duchesne under three shots on goal. The sportsbook line is currently set to two and a half. And we actually have an even line or more juice on the under opposed to the over here on Pinnacle at minus 116. DraftKings has the under two and a half at minus 105. Barstool minus 129, as you can see, guys, across the board here. And we also are getting the better number on prize picks at three. I would assume this gets bumped down to two and a half at some point today. But right now, 56.5% fair odds percentage for Duchesne to stay under three shots on goal. Last time I made this video, we had my boy Heiskanen. I, I believe that's how you pronounce it. Again, Miro Heiskanen. We had the under of three, I believe, last time. Now Prize Picks has his line at two and a half. And again, that is too low. We are going to be taking the over of two and a half shots on goal here for Miro Heiskanen. The sportsbook line is set to two and a half. And look at these odds. Minus 148 on Pinnacle. Minus 148 on FanDuel. Minus 150 on DraftKings. Uh, minus 145 on Bovada. So some real good book agreements here on the over of two and a half. Again, we have a fair odds percentage of 55.5%, a really good another leg to add to our six-man flex. Next on the list, we have Logan Couture under two and a half shots on goal, a minus 141 average across the board. Again, Barstool has some pretty egregious lines here, but still, Pinnacle, minus 143, DraftKings, minus 145, Bet online minus 146, Bet365, minus 160. So again, book agreements here on the under here for Couture under two and a half shots on goal, a minus 141 average, 55.2% chance, fair odds percentage to hit the under. Our fifth leg is gonna be James Wiseman under eight and a half rebounds. 
minus 177 pinnacle line on the under the rest of the books look to be more so around that minus 135 minus 140 average bet online also minus 167 but when we look at it sportsbook line is the same as prize picks both set to eight and a half but we do have heavy juice on the under here 55.2 percent fair odds percentage for wiseman to stay under eight re- eight and a half rebounds excuse me and last but not least Our last leg to the six-man flex, it's going to be JT Miller over two and a half shots on goal. Again, a minus 142 average, 55.21% chance to hit, same as James Wiseman. Another really, really good play to have in a six-man flex. Minus 148 line on Pinnacle to go over, minus 140 on DraftKings. So some good book agreements. Again, minus 150 on Bovada as well. So guys, that is the six-man flex. It's as easy as pulling up the optimizer getting the best odds from the industry and all of the markets. So guys, that's going to do it. That's all it is. I pulled up the optimizer. I look at the top six plays. If I think they're viable in my eyes, I take them. And guess what? The math does it for me. So I know that they're viable. I'm comparing the market from the sportsbook lines to the prize picks lines. Again, we do all the math for you by taking all the implied odds, computing them to fair odds. So taking out the vague and the juice from the implied odds that the books incorporate into their lines and we give you that fair odds percentage guys again it's going to be tyson walker over 13 and a half points matt duchane under three shots on goal miro heiskanen over two and a half shots on goal logan couture under two and a half shots on goal james wiseman under eight and a half rebounds jt miller over two and a half shots on goal again if you can't play college basketball all you got to do is just leave tyson walker off this slip and just play those five i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you could please give it a like I'll catch you guys soon. Love you. Take care.